Payoneer, they're merging with a company called FTAC Olympus Acquisition Corp, stock ticker symbol FTOC. And it's very surprising to me that people are not talking about this more. Like Payoneer is a competitor to a company, let's say like a PayPal or a Stripe. Uh, Payoneer focuses specifically on um, overseas transactions, transferring like when you pay someone in a different currency and you have to work about work around those currency exchanges and exchange rates. So they're not exactly the same as PayPal. They have a, they focus more on that, but either way, the stock right now has a valuation of about 4.3 billion dollars post merger. And currently that's only their their sales for 2022 are projected to be around 540 million dollars. The payment growth space, especially online, is growing at an exponential rate. And in 2020, Payoneer was forecasted to handle about 44 billion dollars in payment volumes. That was double what they handled in 2018. And the way they make money is through this uh, something called a take rate, where they take a small percentage of a, like really all of the transactions and all the dollar amount that flows through their platform. Payoneer, they're forecasting a growth of 25% year over year, which is very similar to companies like PayPal and Square. But like I've used Payoneer before. I used them when I paid developers for a startup app I built a while back, a couple years ago. I paid developers in in Europe using Payoneer and it was really easy to use and I really liked it. And most of the time I like investing in companies that I've used before that I like and are easy. And this is one of them. So um, while it is a payment processing company, their margins are very high. They say that um, Payoneer is predicting that the transaction uh, it says they, they have about 72% margins and the company is still predicting, you know, 20% to 25% revenue growth over the next couple of years. Um, either way though, right now, a lot of people are overlooking this company. Um, most of these SPACs right now have insane valuations that are like 50 X their, their revenue five years down the road, but that's not the case with Payoneer. Payoneer, 2022 sales are $540 million. The valuation is around $4.3 billion. So it's only 8X. And really, it has a pretty good valuation. When you're looking at the industry they're in, you're looking at online payments and online payment processing, continuing to see that grow. And the company, it's not like it's small. It works in 190 countries worldwide. It handles $44 billion in 2020 in total payment volumes. And it's growing very quickly. So either way you look at it, I think this stock is really overlooked. I think a lot of people are not giving it the attention it deserves. And, you know, this is going to be a competitor to companies like Square and PayPal in the future. And it already is. $40 billion is nothing to look down upon that they process every year. That is a significant amount of money. And I just think people are not giving it enough attention. But let me know what you guys think about that.